Yeah, as you can hear, it's pretty windy outside. Now off in the background, that's El Paso, Texas. And beyond that little pyramid mountain, that's Mount Cristo Rey, that's Mexico. But yeah, this abandoned tank turned kind of into a giant canvas for local graffiti artists, vandals, call them what you will. Oh yeah, it's a popular spot for people to hang out up here in the desert. Yeah, here's the other side of that tank. You can see somebody's got a lot of confidence in themselves. Whoever drew that. But here's the pump house. This is actually a well as well, so no pun intended. Let's get inside there. Check it out. Jeez. Looks like somebody hooked up a truck and just ripped the door off. Oh, wow. The electric motors are still in here. Along with a ton of debris. But yeah, this was a well. And they pump the water out from the underground and fill up this tank for drinking water. In this area of southern New Mexico that I actually live in. So let's see if we can get inside this tank. All right, here's the entrance. Somebody took the time to take all the bolts off of the, the cover that went on here. Let's take a peek inside, make sure there's no surprises. Nope, nobody in there. Let's get inside. All right, we made it through. Now we're inside this pretty large water tank. Let's see if I can give it some more light. I don't know if you can hear that eerie groaning sound of the wind going around the outside of this tank. It's looking up at the top. It's actually pretty warm in here. Yeah, you can see this has turned into a party spot for a lot of the locals around here. Yeah, there's an access hatch way up there on the top. This kind of reminds me of Thunderdome, that movie. That's pretty cool. They've actually, uh, some people have shot through this plate steel. Bolts have actually penetrated and it's leaving uh, little dots of sunlight on the floor. Man, just think of this, like this used to hold drinking water and you see all of this dirt and debris. If this was actually in here when this was being used or just blew in over the years from the wind. I'm not certain, but I'm sure this was a, a water supply for my drinking water not too long ago. This has only been decommissioned for maybe a couple of years, it hasn't been that long. But you can hear, hear my echo in here. It's, it just sounds like I'm in a giant tunnel. I'm standing right in the center of it now, so let's look up. Yep. All right, here's just a wide angle view of this tank. This decommissioned water tank. I wonder how long it's gonna be standing because there's a lot of metal. There's a lot of metal that goes into this, and I'm sure they can repurpose it. But yeah, it's just decided to take a short little trip. It's been a while since I've been out to the mines. I've got a lot going on between 
work, school, and family. So I'll get out there soon, guys. Thanks for watching.